Next, under the hammer, bygone bygones, we've got this lovely little chest of drawers, little three-drawer three chest of drawers. It looks like an oak veneer on a uh, pine carcass. It's got these beautiful handles on it. I mean, it's going for a song. It's almost worth getting it just for these handles, to be honest. But it has got shabby sheep potential written all over it. Give this a couple of coats with an Annie Sloan paint and a, a bit of a rub back with some sandpaper, and you could be looking at a completely different piece of furniture. It's got that lovely little detailing to the top ridge there. It looks like it was once upon a time a dressing table and it maybe had some sort of a mirror or something attached to the uh, to the top by the uh, markings on the back. It's got scratches and scuffs and... Uh, well, it's not got that many chips, actually. It's got a couple of little bits of damage. chips on the face here. Oh, yeah, on the side down at the bottom. But other than that, it's in very good condition. It has got a maker's uh, stamp on the back, HLL, registered trademark, and a British standard kite mark, 1960-2001. I think it's made a lot nearer the 1960s and 2001. It's probably more 1940s, 1950s, this one. Lovely little thing. Oh, the, uh, the drawers themselves, in good condition. We've got dovetail jointing. There, we've got dovetail jointing at the back, we've got a solid wood back and sides, and then actually, the uh, the bases to them are a lovely big piece of ply with a really nice, really nice pattern finishing on them, that one in particular. Nice piece. Great little practical drawers. It would look fantastic in a child's bedroom because it's got that kind of miniature quality about it. Yeah, it's probably only about two and a half feet high, isn't it? Yeah. Nice. We sell things in other places, so if you want to secure this from selling anywhere else than eBay, then get an opening bid on before it's gone.